Magnus Janssen, my name is Charlotte Holmquist, co-founder of Manetos Labs, and we have developed a technology to digitalize the fuse box. If you see on a traditional circuit breaker, it's pure mechanics, and it serves one purpose only today, and that is safety. So we have transformed this or changed this uh, mechanics into electronics. By doing that, for the first time, we can use the circuit breaker to communicate, measure and control everything in a house. It's also about 10,000 times faster, because electronics is always faster than mechanics. And I can imagine why no one else has done this before. The challenge has been quite tough. We had to deal with the size. I mean, we have to fit it into a DIN format. We have to deal with heat. Uh, galvanic insulation is actually a word I didn't know of before. And uh, we also have to deal with the security standards and power supply. So the challenge has been tough, but now we have the prototype in the production. We see two key target segments. It's both utilities and the homeowners. I think the largest potential is among the utilities. They can use it for the both demand-side management and integrating it into a smart meter. I mean, we can read in real time with very, very high resolution. And obviously, using this, it's a platform for smart home services for the end users. But I will talk more about why it's so important for the utilities. We can see three big megatrends happening. I mean, it really took off 2010 with an Agivende. Those are examples from Germany, but the same is happening throughout Europe. We have the decentralization. In Germany, went from 800 energy producing units to 1.5 million. I mean, it's all about the solar and the windmills coming up. Liberalization of markets. Germany went from 1 to 150 electricity providers. It's great, but it's also a challenge with more renewable, more units, where they need something to stabilize the grid. And we do that through digitalization. We connect the consumers, the producers, to optimize and make it more flexible. I think a very good example is Next Kraftwerke, which you from Enico very well know of. And this is a picture from their website. They connect 4,500 producers and consumers. I was very curious when I saw a residential house and I clicked on that image and think you can read, private households are not included in the virtual power plant yet. However, in the future, and that's where we come in, I mean, the residential buildings consume 38% of the electricity, more than transportation, industrial and commercial, but they are yet ignored because the lack of technology. And that's our key target segment. Besides the benefit from the utilities, I mean, this is an infrastructure to connect everything you already have in a home. At Manetos, we focus on three applications to start with. We will open up the platform for more people to develop or companies. But our core services are EV charging. You can charge your vehicle when the prices are low. My favorite, uh, my kids are quite lazy. They don't really switch off the lights. So everything is auto off when the last pe person leaves the home. And of course, heating. We are already working with water-based heating, but now we can approach direct electrical heating, a huge opportunity in France with over 20 million homes using direct electrical heating. We see the pricing model being a bundled offering. I mean, the homeowner, ideally, they don't pay for it at all, but if they allow a little bit of demand response, a good benefit for the utility, they only pick the monthly fees for the different kind of applications. I mean, maybe they can download it from, from App Store, we have over-the-air updates on the equipment. The numbers are huge. We don't aim to become a hardware manufacturer, even though the market is 20 million billion dollars, but we focus on the demand response and smart energy services. And lastly, our go-to-market strategy, we have Flex as production partner, discussing a license in production and potentially global reselling. We have a dialogue with a few of the largest companies in hardware manufacturing for circuit breakers. Potentially resellers, we just want to gain volume to launch the services, the smart services. We already have collaboration with two um, Nordic utilities doing pilots next year. Of course, French high priority, as I mentioned, and we want to team up with the virtual power plants because we see that it makes a perfect fit. At Manetos, we already, uh, in the group company, we already have one product out in the mar market that is for water-based heating systems. Um, you could call it a smart thermostat, but it's not really. 
Um, we already have distribution of this product through utilities, partnerships with Tilia Company. Additionally, uh, now we will go with Media Markt. So we start with using those channels to connect our electricity control, the heating control, and combine it to a platform. What we are looking for, I mean, we're always looking for funding, but more important is a partner developer, so a big company that we can develop this jointly together with because the market opportunity is, is quite big. Thank you.